So we're looking today at number three, Carl Glaze Place. The reason I'm on the front here is I just wanted to show you the proximity of the cottage to the harbour front. So this is obviously it's quite a pleasant, nice day today. We'll cut this little cobbled street here up into Carl Glaze Place. It's number three we're looking at. Harbour there, and the property we're looking at is just here on the left hand side. It's a really nice cottage on three levels. It's been lived in for nearly 60 years. It's been the same, same family for 60 years, and been lived in all that time, and previously, obviously, lived in for the time before that, too. It's currently laid out as three bedrooms. You've got a bedroom downstairs, two bedrooms upstairs, although you have to walk through one of the bedrooms to get to the other one. You've got a lounge, nice little kitchen downstairs, and a shower room. It does need some work, but yeah, fantastic little place. Oh, actually, just before I go in, there's two entrances too. So we've got the entrance that you can see above us there, the brown, the brown surround. And there's another entrance here. I'm walking through the back here. There's some work going on here at the moment next door. And the other entrance is uh, this little door here, which takes you into this little courtyard. So two entrances, close to the hub from Need some work, but it's a great little cottage. Let's uh, go up the steps and have a quick look inside. Okay, so we're coming into the property now. You're walking through these doors into this it's a really good sized little lounge area. To the front here, we've got a sash window with a uh, little window seat. And a double glazed window to the rear. This little area here is the stairs that take you downstairs to the kitchen. I'll take you down the room and then we've got these handmade stairs that take you upstairs to the bedroom, which I'll show you now. So as I said, we've got this really nice bedroom up here, good size. Got two sash windows to either side, so it's nice and bright and light. There's a couple of power points. But it's a very decent sized room into this smaller bedroom here. So there is a, a walkthrough effectively. So you've got you know, nice for family effectively if you're having a, um, another room straight off. But and there's possibilities here to change that staircase around to make two broad bedrooms up here. So there's options. Let's take it back down. And then we'll go downstairs. I may have to turn around here, so it's a, a trick of the staircase. And that takes you downstairs, so it's really quite sweet. Kitchen, living area. So we've got a range of units. There's a little radiator down here. We've got a stainless steel sink unit. In this cupboard here that you can see in front of me is a fridge freezer. To the left is the boiler and a bit of storage. There's power points down here and a window and door to the rear, which I've just shown you from the uh, from the first part of the video out into that small little square. TV points and then into a shower room where we've got this big double walk-in shower cubicle. It's all mains connected, wash hand basin and WC with a heated towel rail and swing around to, to my left. And finally, down here on this level, there's another small little bedroom with a window to the front. Small bit of wardrobe under the stairs there to my right, and an electric radiator. So it's a cracking little property. As I said, very close to that harbour front. It's, it's literally just sort of 10, 15 steps away. It probably does need some work, um, admittedly. Uh, but there's plenty of opportunities here to reconfigure it how you want. Great little property. For more information, please give us a call. Thanks.